Hey guys, it's Allie. Welcome back to the channel. I have another little bit of a CC haul for you guys. Um, this one only has tops, bottom shoes, hats, and full body outfits, I believe. I wasn't really able to find really any accessories or skin details that I really liked enough to, you know, show off. So if you guys love or have any, are familiar with any CC creators um, that make really good accessories or skin details, like primarily, definitely let me know because I need more of those. Absolutely. Um, especially makeup too. It's really hard for me to find creators that I, I really like the makeup. I don't know why I'm just really picky about it. Um, but I do want to say thank you to all of these wonderful, beautiful creators in this video. These items are some of my literally my most favorite items of all time. And I will put a little bit of a warning here, a little bit of a disclaimer. Some of these items can be considered like alpha-ish. Um, I personally play Maxis Mix. I do a little bit of um, Maxis Match items and then alpha items. That's just how I like to play. I like diversity in my game and stuff like that. Um, so if you are not a big fan of alpha, you can just, you know, pick the things out. Just, just see whatever kind of fits your style um, and go from there. So we're going to go ahead and get started with hairs, which I am literally so freaking excited about. I can't even begin to explain to you how blown away I am at how good custom content has been getting. Like, I don't know about you guys let me know but just like I, just the quality of these items are just so magnificent and it's just it's just insane so let's go ahead and get started with our first hair here this is actually called the merida hair by mirror dreams i just picked this up today and oh my god the the length the curls the just the shine like it typically shiny hairs in the game are not really my style but i will not have an issue probably using this in my game um i want to see i actually haven't seen okay there's like multiple colors i did not know that i did not check that at first um but oh my god like it even works i feel like it works a little better with the lighter colors just because it doesn't really look like shiny as shiny as you know the darker ones i want to see what it looks like in brown yeah so it's, it's really shiny if that's not your thing i'm sorry <laughs> it's it's not really my thing either but i am going to keep this in my game just because I don't know. I feel like it could be a really good... I, I don't know what you would use this for, honestly. Maybe a wedding or something. But yeah, that's absolutely gorgeous. So this is the Merida Hair by Mirrored Dreams. Next up, this hair is called the Gwen Hair by Preleska. And I actually just picked this up today too. And just everything about this is just, oh my god. Now, I it kind of looks a little gray here. Sorry, my game is just ugh, it's, it's lagging. I'm not gonna lie. Um, It does look a little gray here. But if you do this black squat, or black swatch oh my god sasquatch what the fuck if you do this black swatch here it does look a little bit like normal black if that makes sense um but here it is in some different colors oh my god that oh, that is like a auburn dream holy crap because i know usually this this hair is is brown but for some reason or this hair color is brown but for some reason this hairstyle is making it look like auburn i am in love how does it look with the oh yeah perfect perfect i prefer this absolutely with the lighter colors uh, again it just looks a little bit more natural but here it is in some pinks oh yes i i love this i love preleska i don't i don't usually pick up too many of her hairs just or their hairs just because I, I'm just not really a big fan of the style, but this one I'm definitely going to be using. So yeah, love that. This is the Gwen hair. Okay, so if I'm pronouncing this correctly, I believe this hair is called the Armand hair by Natalia Aditor. And uh, again, I usually don't go for these. I have one of her hairs right here. It's like this high pony. Um, and I didn't really think I was going to get anything else from this creator. But yeah, this is this is just amazing. Can, have you guys noticed I'm picking up a lot of long, long hairs? It's really because I just didn't have enough. Like, I'm not going to lie. There's not many creators out there that I know of that make, you know, hairs this long. I just love it so much. And I love how there's more colors to choose from. I mean, look at that. We got the mac and cheese hair. Okay, you can you can do a light blonde light blonde um what is this we have this like cherry red oh that's just gorgeous goes all the way down to the butt that's what i'm talking about gosh i want to get my hair this long i i just love it so much but here's a couple more swatches um and some browns we got some blues oh i love that i love the blues wow i love those tones they're not like they're not in your face or what is that what is the word what is the word pastel yeah okay yeah i love that i love that 
I love that so much. So this is the Armand hair. Next up is actually another one of my favorites. It is adorable. I love the bows to death and I love that they come with the hair. I do kind of wish this hair came without the bows as well, like a second option, but you know, it's totally fine. It makes up for its beauty. Okay. So this is the Summer Constellations hair by Kei Gochu, I think. Yeah. Again, just giving me major cottagecore vibes, like the bows, the, the, the fringe in the front. Like I wish my hair looked like this. So here it is in black um here's some browns as well yeah wow i like i just love this like the detail in the back i it, it just looks so full like I, I really like when a when a custom content hair just looks really full if that makes sense like i really appreciate that yeah like the the blondes are everything um here's silver ah uh, i love it i love it so much there's gray and we have some pinks and then you know the greens and the blues of course yeah i love the name too it's it's beautiful but yeah that is the summer constellations hair all right this next one is daylife sims and it's called the sabrina hair but i it says met so i don't know if it's like talking about like the met gala or something like i i don't know but it, it's called the sabrina hair but met okay so you know i i listen i love daylife sims i don't use these hairs too too much just because again the shine kind of throws me off a little bit because i'm not too big on like alpha ish um cc hairs but this one i can rock with i can rock with especially if you go with like the lighter colors it doesn't really have that shine effect i feel like it looks a little bit better with um those light colors but here's like a, a honey blonde um yeah so like the the darker you go it does look a little bit more shinier but if you don't care about that all like by all means go for it um but i i really do love this especially for my my blonde sims I needed a really good updo, but, but like messy with fringe, if that makes sense. Like there's not really, I can't find too many of that. So I love this so much. Uh, this is the Sabrina Hair Met Gala, I think, <laughs> by Daylife Sims. I also went ahead and grabbed five other ethnic hairs because I also just really have a hard time finding ones that I, that I really, really like. Um, so I, I this creator um i can't i think it's gg sims yeah this creator oh my god like i am in love with these hairs so this is the nevea hair by gg sims and there's actually four different versions so when you click the link um you should be able to see all four of these I, I love how the bun's so high up it's like it's hard to it's hard to quite see it but yeah i just amazing like i can't i again i can't explain to you how good these custom content creators are getting like holy crap so here's some brown i mean this this one looks literally good in every single swatch like every single swatch and i don't say that for a lot of hair she looks amazing in this blonde um but yeah this is just it's it's perfect perfect updo and um, boho like bohemian this is the bohemian style and then these are the no strand styles but i just i like i like a good boho style so yeah i love it this is the nevea hair by gg sims and obviously my second choice is also from gg sims this is the miriam hair again i love the bohemian style just just a little bit better and this one has a claw clip and i never see ethnic hairs with claw clips in them like i think this is the first one i've i've, I've seen ever so i just i i really hope this creator continues to make these hairs because i am just in love like this is just so what do you mean what do you mean like how did you make this like it's just so dreamy i didn't even i didn't even see like i love the detail i love how the braids are going back into the bun back here um and and the strands is just uh this is perfect so this is the miriam hair by gg sims once again so this hair is similar spelling to the nevea hair from gg sims this is the nevea hair again but it's by jade cat sims and this just came out on the market um and oh my gosh i'm in love i've never it's so unique and i love the claw clips that we got going on right here it's it's amazing i love the trend keep it going keep it going but wow like i i just i've never seen a hair like this but then it works so well it works so well for all of the sims that i've used this on because i've used this uh this hair on a couple of my sims just to kind of test it out to see if i liked it um and it's just it's gorgeous i i just love it so much i love the braids hanging in front i love the curls up here and the claw clip of course like it's just so unique and something i i don't think any other cc creator has really created like this is just something i never would have came up with so yeah i love that so this is the nevea hair by who is it by 
by J. Cat Sims. Okay, sorry. I'm forgetful. This is the Naomi hair by I'm Vikai. I don't quite remember if this is a new hair or not when it comes to, you know, being on the CC, the custom content scene. It's new to me. I have not used it yet. Um, I don't remember if it's if it's been in my um my custom content thing for a while i don't i really don't remember but it's new to me okay i i really don't remember having this i think i downloaded it like a couple days ago honestly i did need kind of a longer ethnic style for my ethnic sim so i i just i love it i love it i love um i i forget what these are called um because i know there's a correct terminology and i forget and i don't want to get it wrong so i will just say i love the length of the style it's gorgeous i really needed something simple um just just clean put together so yeah i love this this is the naomi hair by i'm vikai you know i love me some shea butter and this is the Folay fro by shea butter i love it so much i have some i have some fro's here and there but i don't have anything like this where there are um braids going into the back of it and i just think it's so unique i love the style i really need some more hairs like this i mean as you can see uh i have four of these from shea butter but i need i need more so if you know any creators again that make these types of hairstyles really good really well done let me know um but let's look at it in the different colors yeah amazing amazing as always um i think you get access to all four of these when you click the link um i won't uh show all four of them but yeah this is this is beautiful i love the blondes again it's perfect i remember when we just had this like light blonde color and i just now that i look at it i'm like ugh, like i, I just i just don't like it um this is just a little bit more natural a little bit more you know nice looking i guess um but here's some pinks of course oh wow i love that i love the pinks holy crap uh blues and greens you know it love that so much so this is the foley fro by shea butter so going back to this sim we're going to take a look at tops bottom and shoes i'm just gonna go through the whole outfit all together so it's not really like kind of weird like you're seeing the whole outfit but i'm only talking about the shirt so we're just we're just gonna do that so for the top this is the bohemia sweater by chloe m um i'll actually no i'm not gonna take the hair off i'm too lazy you guys you guys get the gist um but i really needed some good some good turtlenecks and i'm just obsessed with this like honestly this is perfect for your sims christmas time like it like you could wear this just for winter in general but then it does have some christmasy swatches like this one this one actually has um deers on it i love that what is this okay this one also has deers on it but it's like blue and yellow i adore this so much i am putting this on my sims every freaking christmas i swear to god and for the pants these are the parachute bags it's called parachute ba i think they're just parachute baggy jeans or just baggy pants um by baby tears wonderful name no i'm just kidding it's great i'm not judging but i love these pants um they actually originally they are black and white but they have so many different swatches i love the pink these are a little bit more alpha just because we have this like texture at the bottom and it just it just looks a little bit more textured in general but i personally don't mind i really like these i love the belt that's hanging off like i i've actually got a quite quite a few of pants that have like belts hanging off and stuff and i just love the the detail i love the realism and ads like you actually see like the belt coming off i love that so for shoes i, I feel like i'm taking off all her clothes i love this let's just put her in in a skirt yeah that's fine these are the star fuzzy boots by gius oh my or gius or gius i don't know i don't know um but i i am obsessed with this creator the shoes they make are phenomenal like i don't think it, it's it's gs and it's madeline that really make the best shoes in my opinion um but these i, I wish i could scroll in for you I, I don't know how to do that but like literally just go to the link and check it out for yourselves i love these so much they're adorable i love the bow of the stars these are so freaking cute they're everything um and there's only one more swatch but it's, it's just white and i think those are even cuter because you can pretty much use those for anything but even the brown ones like brown really goes with with almost everything i guess <laughs> so yeah i love these so much this is the kitten sweater by Beto and <laughs> i love it it is so adorable it has plain swatches if, if that's just your thing you, you just have a really plain sweater it's a little bit more alpha of course but i didn't want to show this off but when you go to um the other swatches with the, with the like the white on the bottom they have little like pictures of cats here's a dog i mean if dogs are your thing go for it i love this one so much this is adorable we have this one 
this one that one i love that we have this one <laughs> and that one that is just oh my gosh i love it it is so cute <laughs> um definitely could wear this really any any time but i would probably put my sims in this for um sleeping sleepwear and these biker shorts are from set 238 from turk simmer i'll go ahead and take all of her top i'm so sorry um but these are another pair of biker shorts and they only have tie-dye swatches which i'm obsessed about i don't know something about tie-dye biker shorts they just they just make me so happy it's like it's there's just so much going on and i'm like yes um so if you need some more biker shorts for your sims that kind of add a little bit of a pop of color to their outfit definitely go ahead and pick these up i love them so much honestly a lot of i think i don't know if all of these shoes are from um gs in in this video so i might just not say the names of them honestly and just link them down below but these are some sandals that i picked up from gs they're originally green um they're like birkenstocks but there's so many different colors like if you wanted you know regular ones you could do brown i love that swatch that looks amazing these could be really good for like your hiking sims your outdoorsy sims or just if you want to put these on your sims at su in summertime or something like i am obsessed and just the amount of swatches that gs puts into their shoes it's amazing there's something for everybody um so yeah these are some birkins i guess some some sandals from gs up next we have the fabian top by baby tears again i really needed uh, a simple striped specifically tank top but this actually has a bunch of swatches and it has a bunch of plain swatches too so if you just want like a basic pink tee or top or a basic white top um i really i just love this it i stuff like this like clothes like this really make me feel like make the game feel more realistic because sometimes i'm just gonna throw on a basic white tee like i'm not gonna wear like all these elaborate things you know what i'm saying um but if you don't want any of you know the basic plain swatches there are striped swatches which i really enjoy that was what i was going for in the beginning um and these aren't really stripes they're more like i don't i don't know how to say that like ruffles i guess um in the pattern but these are really thick stripes here um and you have like this this black and pink swatch here as well so i love that so much these are the kayla jeans by none other than serenity you guys i'm sure you've already you might have seen this set i just actually picked it up um but i am obsessed with the pattern especially on this swatch um but of course you have like your plain plain jane um jean swatches as well but i'm just loving how bell bottoms are coming back into style like they're just so they they're so breezy i love it i hate being constricted by skin tight jeans so i just i love these they are absolutely perfect and for shoes i'm just gonna go ahead and put her in some some shorts that's fine these are the flower heeled mules by gia so once again i am obsessed with the heel i actually did not know when i picked these up that the heel was a literal flower like are you kidding me like, i don't know how well i'd be able to walk on that but holy crap that is just that is so unique i've never seen anything like it i I love it. I love the flowers, the flower detailing here. I just, this is everything. Like, I, I just cannot i cannot deal with this man this is amazing thank you so much gs i i just love these go ahead and pick these up guys they will make your day they will make your game this next top is just really called a top and cardigan by mysterious oh oh i love it i love it again a little bit more alpha e but if you don't mind that that's fine i just i love striped things um and i just i love it i especially love when a top comes like as a set if that makes sense like it's a it's a shirt but it's also it also has a jacket on it so essentially i don't have to download like a separate jacket to put on my sims i really love this i love the different swatches i love me some striped sweaters the best time to wear a striped sweater so this is the pandora skirt by clumsy alien and this skirt is actually not new it's been around for a while but for some reason i just failed to remember that the skirt has plain swatches like i never knew how i could really like use all of these in in the ways that i wanted to and then i was like oh oh wait <laughs> there are literally plain swatches and it just goes so well with this top i love it so much so i didn't really just pick this up but i recently just found out kind of that it has plain swatches i know that sounds so dumb um but ex excuse my um dumbness yeah i love it i love it so much pandora skirt by clumsy alien these next shoes are by Merm mermelade sims i think it is and they are these like pearled mules i guess you could say pearl embellished mules i am obsessed um these are also really unique i 
I've actually, so it's GS Madeline and Mermelade that I'm really going after right now when it comes to shoes. Um, just something about these creators, they're super unique and I love the way it like, like dips. Like, I don't know how to explain it. And like the, the, what is this called? Like the actual heel part is like so unique. It's so retro, I guess is the word I'm trying to say. Um, but you have a plain like cream swatch and you can do white as well. This would be a great wedding shoe. Honest to God, like that is beautiful. Um, but you also have black here. Um, you have reds. I love that so much. And, and just some more kind of pastel y um colors so yeah i love it so much awesome job mermaid baby tears once again has come out with some of the best crap this is the bang bang hoodie by baby e tears this is just so amazing it looks so like i don't know can you see the shadows like that is just something else i don't know how um like sims like cc creators are able to create that because i know some because like for this one, for example, which this is actually linked in my last video, go check it out. Um, but you can see like really, like really dark shadows. And I don't know something about that. I really like, um, but in the thumbnail, it's pink, which I don't, I'm not really a big fan of that one. I'm more so like the white. I like the darker colors, honestly, because you don't see that much of a shine, but it also has like this, um, this striped version which i actually have something like this um in real life so that's great i love that so these are the y2k wide jeans by you know sims again this is a little bit more alpha so you know get at your discretion um but yeah like i was saying the whole like belt hanging off like i just something about that is just so endearing i'm like ugh this is perfect it's so like it's so me because listen i hate belts and like especially if i eat a lot i am unbuttoning the crap out of my pants uh i want to be bloated um when i feel like it and so i just it's something about like un she didn't actually unbuckle the belt but i don't know it just makes me feel like she just had like a really big dinner and she's like ah oh, perfect <laughs> like i'm free yeah i love these so much there is a black swatch as well which is amazing but i really love this this darker this darker version too so these definitely are not max's match um but i i really do love them regardless here are the last shoes these are from gs again of course um i didn't i haven't quite looked up the name of them yet but i think they're like yule sandals or, or something like that i really don't know but i just again i love these i love how gs makes a bunch of different things <laughs> like literally just go to gs's patreon and just scroll and you will find like all of this stuff like rain boots tennis shoes sandals like i i'm uh, heels i'm just obsessed um but i love these a lot again these give me very much like outdoorsy vibes for your outdoorsy sims i love the swatches are just plain muted browns which i really enjoy and you have a, a black swatch here as well um so yeah i love you so much awesome job gs you are an amazing creator love ya so for full body outfits i am so excited about this this is the harley coat by simpliacity i cannot even explain to you how much i am so excited about finding this creator i mean i am just obsessed because you know as you can see this person makes um bathing suits as well so definitely check out simpliacity like i i just thought that simply asked you made hairs um or i mean i might be thinking about like two different creators i'm not sure but yeah this is amazing i am a much bigger fan of the darker kind of muted colors than the lighter ones but they also have these different patterns as well so you can really if you want if you're very alpha you can go for the shiny leather look um but if not there's you know plain like checkerboard swatches i guess um i just i love this so much this is just so like i want to say it's creative um i know a lot of cc creators have made stuff like this but just the amount of swatches and just the the level of detail on the leather if, if you're into that is just amazing i personally will probably just have my sims wear like these brown swatches and stuff like that and maybe some of the checkered swatches but yeah i i just i love this so much i love it it's definitely good for like um winter wear and stuff like that this is the flower knit sweater dress by rimmings rimmings is also another creator that i've really been obsessed with lately but this one is new on the market and i just i love it so much the skirt does only stay black i don't know how to feel about that i wish maybe it could be like different colors but honestly i'm still gonna use this anyway so you just got all these literally just the sweater changes but if you go here it has like two-tone sweaters which if you're into that i i love that so much but i'll probably just keep it like keep it muted keep it with the browns and and the pinks and i really love this one though i love the gray so 
yeah this is uh oh i forgot it but it's by rimming so go ahead and pick it up this is the basic long cashmere cardigan dress oh my gosh say that 10 times freaking fast by rimmings again again <laughs> i love how the belt is hanging off such good detail i love the pockets here they're kind of uneven which is really cute um like they're like it's not a bad thing at all it just shows more character in the dress like this could be a robe very much if you wanted to but honestly i also see it as more just like a like a sweater dress if that makes sense um which is i think it's how it's intended to be but you could make this a robe like this literally looks like a robe um so yeah i love the swatches i love how we have darker swatches as well as kind of lighter swatches if you know you want a, a pop of color so thank you rimmings this is amazing i love it this is a cheryl matching set by simpliacity once again we have some basic swatches here this one definitely looks more like maxis match 100 percent um there is a little bit of texture here but i just i feel like it looks a little bit more um like cartoony which is not a bad thing at all it's just maxis match esque um but you have your basic swatches right here i love this this could definitely be like a really good party dress for sure i don't know why i'm thinking like bachelorette like if you want to use this um for like your sims bachelorette parties like this would be popping and there's not only um basic swatches like basic plain swatches it has so many patterns which i'm obsessed about we have checkerboard we have that cheetah print um more checkers we have polka dots oh i love this this one's gotta be one of my favorites oh my gosh i'm obsessed but yeah simply ask me amazing creator i love this so much super simple throw it on your sims i mean you can even wear this for every day honestly so love this so this outfit is by plaza sims and let me explain so i actually i'm gonna show the rest that i do have but i actually found out that this creator makes like custom and like already made halloween costumes and i was like no freaking way because when we have like halloween in the sims or, or spook I, oh my gosh i literally forgot what it's actually called because i have it called halloween in my game for realism but you know what i'm talking about um i hate having to like manually put my sims in in costumes that are just the same over and over again and so i found these from plaza sims and i was like this this is literally a dream come true like these are so well made we have a cowboy we have like the pirate um this like corpse bride i guess and then we have like this witch um the hats i don't think come with it or you might be able to, da to download them separately i didn't um but even just like the actual outfits are amazing and a cop and a sexy cop i <laughs> i'm obsessed i love these so much so i'm kind of showing you guys all of them i'm gonna link um one of them in the description but you should be able to find all of them if you search this creator's page um but these are just so well made and i i'm very appreciative for stuff like this so so thank you plaza sims this is this is amazing i did go ahead and pick up some new hats and i am obsessed again like these are also so very well made so these are the coven hats by blobberry pancakes so there's actually multiple different versions here there's like a, a right and a left and then like this shorter version and then this like it it just goes i love this one too oh my god so i'm gonna link this one right here but if again if you search this creator's page you will absolutely be able to find these i'm obsessed i love this so much it's giving like it's i don't know i don't know how to feel about it. like wild west vibes but also like classy lady vibes like it's just it's amazing i love this so much um there's different swatches here that kind of change the the bottom rim of the hat there's you you literally blues there's a green hat you have this like brown swatch and then you have these other swatches that i'm really not that big of a fan of just because oh that red is gorgeous oh my god but i'm not really a big fan of the pattern ones um just because because I, I don't know. I just feel like um, these ones look a little bit more clean. Um, but yeah, I love it so much. This is the Coven Hat by Blawberry Pancakes. This is the Cat Beanie by Rimmings. Rimmings also makes some amazing and cute freaking hats. Um, this does have English on it. So if you're not really that big of a fan, definitely skip this one. Um, it's also a little bit more alpha at the top. But honestly, I do not care. Uh, we do not care. <laughs> Rimmings is just amazing. I love the swatches on this as well. You have a light pink, some, some really pastel-y colors, but also some dark colors if you want to do like a dark black beanie or like a dark green or blue and there's this bright red one which oh my god that's in your face i'm not really that big of a fan of that one i'm more so like the lighter colors but yeah this is the cat beanie by ribbings next up is the bad decisions hat by evil sims i think evil i'm not sh quite sure how to pronounce it um but i also love this so much i love the details here i love the safety pins i have never really seen a hat like this 
in the sims 4 i mean correct me if i'm wrong but there's a bunch of different swatches here it's like a kind of like a handkerchief kind of vibe you even have like chains hanging off of the side like it's it's amazing so here we have like a a green swatch right here there's like little x's on the bottom and like little studs coming out there's a star it's just it's perfect um but there are some different pattern swatches some different like checkerboard swatches um but i'm honestly just i really am a fan of of the more muted tones when it comes to hats um but yeah this is the bad decisions hat i wonder what the bad decision was hmm. i mean this hat wasn't a Bad decision like this is amazing this is the fluffy hat by uh oh taj again a little bit more alpha e i honestly i don't know how to feel about this i picked it up and i was like hmm interesting um it's just it the texture is a little is a little funky but honestly i really i don't care Ooh, i like this one yeah so honestly i think the i like the patterned the patterned on this more than i do like the normal version um what does it look like without the hair yeah so it's like patterned up here and like plain right here i honestly like the pattern version more so i am going to keep this in my game but if you're not that big of like you know this kind of texture you can definitely skip this one but i, I do really think this was well made um i really enjoy it it's super cute next up we have the poof animal hat by jelly paws i love this too again a little bit more alpha e with the texture but i personally like this just a little bit better um than the one we saw earlier i can't find it oh my gosh um but yeah i love this one a lot it's adorable honestly it's like i don't i don't know if it's too like i don't know how many people wear these types of hats like oops wrong hat i don't know how many people wear these types of hats just out um but i i would love this for like maybe a halloween costume or honestly i'm not gonna lie i'm probably gonna put it on my sims for their outerwear just because it's freaking cute i love it to death oh my gosh but yeah this is the i think it puffy poofy animal hat Oh, it's great. I love it. So that's all the CC I have for you guys today. Let me know what you guys think. If you're going to download any of this stuff, I love like all of these items. Like there's just something about the quality of custom content that, that is just getting so much better. And it's, I'm not going to lie. I have been a little disappointed with, with EA's game, with EA's game lately. Okay. Because we are having custom content creators step up to the plate. Okay. So we'll just have to see if they get better. I honestly, if they get better, I'm probably going to have a stroke. Like I'm going have a seizure like, i just want to be able to breathe like i already <laughs> i already cannot function with how good these things are so i'm i'm definitely looking forward to how they how they could improve in the future so let me know what you guys think again and i will talk to you guys soon bye